In this video, we're going to be talking through your seated muscle up transitions and your box muscle up transitions. Okay, so these are two exercises that we use to help improve familiarity with your ring muscle up transition and help you get a feel for the timing of the hip pop in relation to your pull. On both exercises, you want to put an emphasis on the hip hop to allow that to give you the height to reach the rings before you pull yourself over into that catch position. Obviously, this replicates what you need to do on the high rings, but with a little bit more time to think, less to focus on, and obviously not having to lift your, your full body weight over the top of the rings, okay? So as well as thinking about that hip pop, all right, we also want you to be thinking about keeping your feet lower than your hips as you transition, which again is important when it comes to doing your full muscle ups. Obviously, it's a little bit easier to focus on this on the seated transition because your feet are gonna stay on the floor, but you wanna make sure that you think about this when you go from the box as well, and you really wanna emphasize it being a hip driven movement as opposed to a leg driven movement, because obviously if your kip's more leg driven when you go for a full muscle up, okay, that's gonna end up with you kicking your legs up quite high, which can make your transition a little bit harder, but also can make the ring swing around quite a lot, which will then make it a little bit more difficult for you when it comes to stringing your reps together, okay? Um, obviously as well, as you, do, as you do your transition on both these exercises, you wanna make sure that you're focusing on keeping the rings in nice and tight to your body, so you can catch yourself in a well-supported dip position, and make sure that you let your hands rotate around the ring so that your wrists are pointing straight up. Obviously this is especially important if you find that when you do go for a full muscle up, you end up getting the height and being in a reasonable position, but you just can't quite get far enough over the rings to be able to hold yourself in that position. Okay, so letting, you, letting your hands rotate around the rings is gonna put your wrist in a stronger position to support your weight, which is gonna make holding yourself in that transition much easier. Okay, 